The weather gets warmer. It's easy to cross the line of business casual to casual business. Marketing expert Olala Jenga joins us to share four tips to help you stay cool at work and still look hot without breaking the dress code rules. And you have four S's you should look out for, starting with sleeves. Sleeves, and I'm breaking one of my you own rules. You are breaking the rule, I'm but you're the boss, sleeveless. right? That's right, I'm the boss, I own the company, I get to break the rules. But, it, but in general, um, not wearing sleeves is kind of not okay for women in the workplace. But I say, you don't have to have Michelle Obama arms to do sleeveless, but they should be kind of nice looking arms. So if you don't, and you have like an extra arm, growing under uh -huh. there, do cap sleeves. They go right over the shoulder. It's a little more modest, but it keeps it feminine. But for guys, the sleeve issue is they forget that they got something growing mm. under there. <laughs> so if your underarm rainforest. hair, yes, a rainforest. <laughs> so if your underarm hair is longer than the sleeve on your shirt, you ought to just trim that Oh my gosh, could you imagine? Is that having... a real problem? It happens every day. <laughs> really? What about Every you come up in there and you got, because you know, after a couple times of wearing a nice shirt, you start to get a little deodorant stain. And ditch the shirt. That's all I'm going to say about that. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. That's good advice. Poor Velazquez. Like, that one is just taking you over that the That is so gross. <laughs> all right, let's talk about the S short. Short. Okay, so for women, this is about length. So uh, right at the knee, pretty standard. Just above the knee, keeps it feminine, keeps it flirty, but mid-thigh? Flirty? Flirty. Oh. Flirty is okay. Okay. We're okay. women. How many how many finger lengths is that? <laughs> it depends. I have, I have skinny fingers. Well, it wasn't that I like can, a rule when you were in elementary it school? It was. It was. Four fingers or, uh -huh. or a thumb. Uh -huh. Yeah, uh -huh. thumb length. But mid-thigh for a woman at work is trying too, too hard. Trying way too hard. But oh, for no. guys, you don't have that length issue, but you have types of shorts. Like what kind? Don't do Bermudas and cargos and carpenter. That's too much going on. The pockets, the hooks. That so you're suggesting like uh, walking 80s, short. In, 80s NBA player shorts? I'm not going there. How oh, would that be in a workplace? <laughs> you're getting written up. I mean, we're just done. Hey, I, I guarantee you it'll feel breezy all day, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> For you and your coworkers. <laughs> yes, do a nice walking short. They cost a little bit more, but it's easy to pull it off with a really nice button down knit tee for a guy. So stay away from the cargo stuff. What about sheer? I know it's hot outside when Ooh. women are getting dressed in the morning. They're like, I gotta put something This on, must be a green. southern thing. So, the mm -hmm. maxi dresses for yeah. women are real popular, and the flowy long skirts, okay. right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you gotta translate for them. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> but they don't do the sun check. So, the sun check is put a full length mirror behind you, stand and face the sun. If you stick your arms and legs out and you can see the silhouette of your pots, it is too sheer for a girl to wear to the office. But not for the guys at the office. But to guys, check out. We're not going. You are really getting written up, Mom. <laughs> that, oh guys, my gosh. Our minds. But for guys, it's transparency. The material is a little thinner. So what do you get when you put a hot guy in a cold room with a thin shirt? Nipples poking you out. You get the pokey poke. And so we don't want to do the pokey at work. No, no, it ain't sexy. <laughs> and finally, shoes. Just make sure no flip flops. Okay. Flip flop. Yeah, I get into from men trouble, or women. From men or women. Thank and you, Olala. There you Thank go. Thank you for joining us. <laughs> Have a wonderful day. <laughs>